Beat by Tom V. Strangers, welcome to the show. You're about to witness a fascinating little social experiment. As it turns out, these fine specimen here have never even seen some of my very favorite classics. So, I've decided to try a little experiment with them. During the movie, the participants must decide who they would play as a character. Should that movie ever be adapted into a real-life Dungeons & Dragons game? This week, my lovely little Canadian Labrats and I are going to be watching one of my very favorite movies, Raiders of the Lost Ark. <laughs> Over the last few weeks, my loyal test subjects and I have had to survive off of detritus we found in the void, so this should be a welcome change of pace, unless something unpredictable happens. But first, we're going to... What's this? Um, hold on everybody, one of my modrons is handing me a piece of paper. Who uses paper anymore anyways? A warning of possible telepathic solar flares. It might affect my test subjects, especially if they're from Earth. Oh no, I don't like the sound of that. Cross your fingers everybody, we're going in. <laughs> Cubicles number one through four. Please join in. Now then, for the people at home, please identify yourselves. Hello, my name is Daphne and I live in a cryo chamber. Hi, my name is Kira. Thomas. <laughs> Thomas, today we're going to be watching a movie about treasure hunting. If you could find any treasure in the world, which treasure would it be? Money. <laughs> like what? Gold? Uh, yeah, probably gold. Are you a pirate, Thomas? No, but I used to be. Mm, I think tonight you're going to discover that you're actually a raider. And you up there with the purple room, what's your name? Hi, my name is Zach. Oh, right, Zach. Didn't I see you last week? Look, maybe you can help me with something. I've been hearing a lot of talk from my Moldrons lately about some sort of a play that occurred in a small town named Fresh Air. Some sort of a live theater performance. <laughs> they keep talking about it all the time as they work down my ship's corridors. <laughs> they say, and I quote, the actors were impeccable, moving and evocative but that the beginning of the play was even better when there were giant human-faced larvae attacking people in the audience. They say it was to die for. Have you heard of this? Do you know what they're talking about? Uh, yes, it's a Dungeons & Dragons game happening every Wednesday at 6pm on Twitch on the chronomancers slash twitch dot com I think is the Get link. ready to cry. And uh, it's called so, Lost Chronomancy. If I ever miss the show, is there a VOD I can watch the next few days after? Uh, yeah, it's uh, the Chronomancer's VOD on YouTube. And the guy in there reminds me of someone. Anywho, now then, this week we are slowly creeping out of the void. The interstellar junk heap where we had fled to escape my enemies. The rich and powerful Yerondel family. Thankfully, we do not seem to have been spotted yet by their talented scouts. So this week, my pets, my cosmic chronocue has taken a precedence around Solaron, a giant yellow sun that floats all alone in its lovely little corner of the universe. Reputation has it that no ship captains worth their space salt are crazy enough to plot a course here, as this sun, Solaron, is rumored to actually be intelligent. A sentient sun, if you will. Well, poppycock, I say. A sun is a sun. Poppycock. <laughs> the radiation around Solaron is so intense that it should be enough to prevent any spies sent by the Yehoden family from contacting our enemies and ratting us out while we are in orbit here. So we should be safe, I think, for a little while, maybe a couple of weeks. Well, I'd like to know if the radiation will affect us inside the ship. Not yeah. at all. I hope it no, does. it's just the communication black at all. So what if the spy is on the ship? I hadn't thought about that. Why, have you heard something, Zach? 
Well, I heard Modrons talking. Might be one of them. You think this guy is one of my Modrons? Well, That's I was too. watching uh, Exandria Unlimited, and I saw that someone disguised himself as a robot to deliver a gift and then turned invisible. And maybe, I don't know, it gave me an idea that maybe that's what's happening here. Well, then maybe I should try and eliminate all of my Modrons, have them executed as to not take any chances. I'll do that after the show. Now then, this week, I don't think you get to call the shots on this ship, Kiki. Do you like the Modrons? Once I can escape again. All right, I'll give them the benefit of the doubt, but I have to make an investigation because if we have an invisible spy from the Irondel family on my ship, even if we're around the sun, it's not going to help. So I'll investigate while we watch our movie. Now then, this week, my pets, we shall be tackling a sun-drenched story of hot sand, nasty Nazis, lost treasures, and introducing one of the greatest, most beloved heroes of any generation, Indiana Jones. <laughs> Well, what do you people know about this? Have you ever heard of Indiana Jones before? No. There's treasures in it. It's the story of an adventurer that goes through ancient temples and ancient stuff to find relics. Always fails at the beginning, but then succeeds at the end. Harrison Ford is there. He's beautiful. I love him. He can do no wrong. It's right up there with Harrison Ford. A real man's man. Let me try a little test with you. In my little intro to this movie, I declared that we would be tackling the Indiana Jones series the right way around, starting with this movie, Raiders of the Lost Ark. And here's why, loyal viewers. If the following statement applies to you, please raise your hand. The only Indiana Jones movie I have ever seen in my life is the Kingdom of the Fracking Crystal Skulls. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. I was young. How, how many have never seen an Indiana Jones movie? <laughs> All right. So one has seen the bad one, one has seen none of them, and the two others? I've seen all of them. I don't remember how many, but a couple. I used right. to watch them with my dad. How many is there? The what? fifth one is coming out in a few weeks. Damn. Oh, I'm so good at this! I'm so good at this. <laughs> well, that's why we're starting at the beginning, so that my lovely test subjects can discover these great characters, the mythos, and the sense of adventure before these concepts were all run into the ground 20 years later. You see, as a child, Raiders of the Lost Ark greatly influenced me. It was the first time I was introduced to a female character that could stand her own against the bad guys and even the main character himself. Marion Ravenwood fights in bars, she talks back to people, she drinks people under the table, and wants to make a profit. And back in the early 80s, that was a rather novel concept in movies. Of course, she inevitably reverts back to the damsel in distress in the second half of the movie. This is Indiana Jones' story, after all. But the character of Mariana Ravenwood and the performance of the actress Karen Allen allowed me to want to write better women characters, to want to write them differently. And so she has always held a special place in my cold undead heart since then. Beautiful. Marion is the woman who finally marries Indiana Jones 20 years later at the end of Kingdom of the Crystal Skulls. A much deserved ending for both of them, in my opinion, if not for the fact that it happened in that movie. But here, this was the first time we'd see her, and it was my introduction to writing better female protagonists. Over the years, this movie has become one of my most favorite films of all time. This movie introduces us to one of the most memorable hero themes in cinematic history. The minute you hear the first sounds of a French horn blaring softly in the background, you know you're in for a good time. It's like a Pavlovian response. You know you're going on an indie adventure. It's one of my favorite soundtracks of all time. So sit back and enjoy the show. For if adventure has a name, it must be... Indiana Jones. <laughs> Enjoy. We will. Not like last time. I'll try to. Last time it quacked. Sucked. It was so much fun. What are you guys talking about? Edward? Plan 9 made me want to rip my yeah, eyeballs uh, out of my head. My nine I, I eyeballs. I didn't like this movie. 
All okay, right. Mary Chrysler, let's watch a movie. Let's uh, do this. Oh, it's a mountain. That's a mountain. <laughs> or Paramount. It's like a. Oh, it's it was... a butt. Oh, it's a Lucasfilm. Mm -hmm. That's a. Uh, I didn't uh, even know that. Yeah. Uh, Indiana Cowboy Jones hat. and Star Wars in the same universe confirmed. Whoa. Whoa. Indiana Jones is also Han Solo. Yeah. Yeah. He becomes that in the future. Uh, that's crazy. He becomes dad. That. I mean, he also becomes a dad in the future, but. Yeah, but he yeah, but dies. They, his son kills him. Yeah. Oh. Norman Reynolds, Oops. the lesser Reynolds. Who's the greater Reynold? Ryan? Reynold! Oh! Oh, sorry. <laughs> Don't pronounce it like that. It's Reynold, not Reynold. Ronald? Oh my. It's a scary tomb. George Lucas. George Lucas. Couldn't skip that. That's true. Whoa. Oh, Vito's in here. Uh oh. Poison is still fresh. Three days. They're following us. Oh, he's good. He didn't even die. Why is there black, like, uh, parts at the top and bottom of the movie? It's like so, like, stretched on the sides. Maybe that was the format? No, it was the 80s. Oh my god, it's a gun. Don't murder. Oh! <gasps> the whip. Whoa! BDSM daddy. He's the whip doors. master. A friend of yours? A competitor. Whip master. Oh, that's spooky. And there's spider webs. No, thank you. He's gonna walk in the spider webs? I wouldn't do that. Oh! Did you see on his shoulder? Is it a spider? Whoa. No. Is it a person? No, it was nothing. There's nothing there. I Stop imagining. freaking us out for I'm nothing. I'm imagining spiders. Yeah. Oh, oh no, I'm not. Oh. <laughs> That's fucked up. You did not do the imaginings. But they're not. Um, God, he's he, cool. He doesn't care? Oh, oh no. my. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> oh. So many of them. Disgusting. Uh, I hate it. Mm. Why are they there? So That's many kids up. in our house. Stay out of the light. Stay out of the light? What an adventurer. It's because he knows everything. can get shot. In the light? Yeah, that's not See? exactly an arrow. It's a light activated? I'm never wrong. That's some weird ass alien technology. Oh my god. He gave him the whip. Ooh. He's about to die. Aww. Remember the Dungeons and Dragons movie where I said that uh, the character Ridley Freeborn, he did a lot of things like Indiana Jones? This is where it begins. <laughs> he only watched like the first 20 minutes of Indiana Jones and was like, there, my movie, done. This is me. There's nothing to fear here. Be careful, Satsuko. Oh. Oh. He's gonna get crushed by something. I'm sure of that. That's the miniature of our video. And then he goes shoop with the bag of sand. That Classic. won't work. Tama, you've only seen the bad ones. So you smart. You don't know how this works. I think well, he does it with the crystal skull as well. He doesn't he take it and put something else? Didn't the crystal skull have aliens? Did they melt off a girl's face? Something like that. He's gonna die. <sighs> How would that small bag of sand be the same weight as a big Oh. Oh, oh mother. Tis not. Nope. Oh. Run. Oh. Oh. No time to argue. 
Throw me the idol. I throw you the whip. Give me the whip. Adios, señor. What a what a asshole. That was very bitchy. With the slowest closing door. Yep. The door of closing. Ooh. Well, he got what he deserved. Ooh. Well, there's the big boulder. Big rock. I love how round it is. It's very satisfying. It is. Oh, the spiders! Too well made. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. FBI, drop your weapons. <laughs> Probably a bad idea to steal from the natives. Oof. Whoops. That's why we colonize. Zachary. Doctor Jones. Oh. Again, we see there is nothing you can possess which I cannot take away. Oh, he's basically the guy in uh, Apocalypse Now. All of them protecting him. Yeah. What was his name? Kurtz. You chose the wrong friend. Kurtz Russell. This <laughs> you could warn them if only you spoke of Vitos. Hokana Matuso! Mabata! Uh oh. I'm surprised they didn't say, uh, thanks for saving me the trouble. Thanks for saving me the trouble. That would have been a pretty good line. Pretty basic, but. It was the one in Dungeons and Dragons 2000. Ah. Uh, Zach also copyrighted it in his D&D game. What about the donkeys? Why is no one shooting? There's a scene like this one in, um, in Diana Jones? Pirates of the Caribbean. Oh. Where Jack Sparrow runs and he's just being pursued by... That seems like a pretty Maybe. Jack Sparrow-y thing. Oh, his music. I also played the Lego Indiana Jones when I was younger. <laughs> That's so cool. Thank you for sharing. When I was younger, I was playing with Bionicles. There's a big snake. Oh, that's just my pet snake, Reggie. I hate snakes, Shock. I hate them. Come on, show a little backbone, will ya? Oh yeah, he's scared of snakes. That's better than being scared of birds. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Shots fired. Fuck you. Who would be scared I fear of birds? birds? It's rational and you are all assholes. <laughs> Chambers or cysts. Oh, all the girls are in love with him. I'm not impressed. Was undisturbed and the undisturbed chamber and the grave goods that were found in another. Uh, <laughs> um, my God. That was traumatizing. Uh, oh, <laughs> that's, that's disturbing. Um, any questions? Then? And I will be in my office on Thursday, but not Wednesday. He sounds like a boring teacher. But he's handsome, so it's okay. Yeah. Yep. I'm sure everything you do for the museum conforms to the International Treaty for the Protection of Antiquities. <laughs> I can't be intelligent. What am I, in trouble? You studied under Professor Ravenwood at the University of Chicago. Yes, I did. I haven't really spoken to him for ten years. We were friends, but, uh... had a bit of a falling out, I'm afraid. Our European sections intercepted a, a German communique that was sent from Cairo to Berlin. Oh no. no. The Nazis have had teams of archaeologists running around the world looking for all kinds of religious artifacts. Hitler's a nut on the subject. He's crazy. He's obsessed. I didn't even people. know he had and a mustache. Right now, apparently, there's some kind of German <laughs> Is it so uh, bad? I can't stop looking at it. Tannis development proceeding. Choir headpiece, staff of Ra. Mm. Ra, the Egyptian god of the sun. Ra, 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 ah, uh, uh. ah. Well, the city of Tanis is one of the possible resting places of the lost ark. Je me suis mis la poudre de Dorthos dans l'œil. Daphne! I'm sorry! <laughs> yeah, the ark of the covenant, the chest the Hebrews used to carry around the Ten Commandments. The Hebrews took the broken pieces and put them in the ark. They put the ark in a place called the Temple of Solomon. 
in Jerusalem. Where it stayed for many years. Until all of a sudden, whoosh, is gone. Where? Daphne just Nobody crying. <laughs> Doritos <laughs> juice. They could eat the kids of the Doritos. It's all the fake Takis. Oh. Oh. It's super spicy. I'm going to smell it in the eye. Rip. That's a great way to go blind. <laughs> it really is. Wiped clean by the wrath of God. By the wrath of God. Same. Obviously, we've come to the right man now. Ravenwood is the real expert. Ravenwood is a great this obsession, really. Name for a D and D city. city. Well, what did the Nazis want him for then? Well, obviously, the Nazis are looking for the headpiece to the staff of Ra, and they think Abner's got it. Ra 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 ha ha. Well, the staff is <laughs> a stick in the shape of the sun, with a crystal in the center. Damn. And if you put the staff in a certain place, the sun shone through here and made a beam that came down on the floor here. That's smart. And gave you the exact location of the Well of the Souls. Where the Ark of the Covenant the Well of the Souls. What does this Ark look like? Cabinet with golden angels. Like hey, in the, the super cool video. It's a tomb, like a chest. Good God. Dying people. Now, what's that supposed to be coming out of there? Lightning. Fire. Oh. It's radiant yeah. damage. Whoa. Hearing you talk does radiant damage. <laughs> Isn't it holy damage? In DD, it's radiant. Oh. An army which carries the ark before it is invincible. My character does necrotic damage and radiant damage. I am a menace to society. That is so cool. So cool. Do you think Gen Genkis can add the thing? Yep. <laughs> Did you just call him Genkis? Genkis. Genkis. Genki can. <laughs> Genki I has Genki can. <laughs> Isn't there a K in his name? Yeah, his last name, Khan. Oh, yeah, I guess. And the museum? The museum gets the ark when we're finished. Oh, yes. Oh. Genkis. So he doesn't care about power, he only wants money. Damn. That thing represents everything we got into archaeology for in the first place. Money. Alcohol. You know, five years ago, no. I would have gone out for And hookers. I'm really rather in. Yeah! Got a little Kate Abner. I think I know where to start. Abner. He's gonna be backstabbed by that man. I think so too. She'll still be with him. He'll be backstabbed by everyone in his life. The least of your worries right now, believe me. Indy. That's just how life goes. What do you mean? Well, I mean that for nearly three thousand years, man has been searching for the lost ark. That's why it's lost. Nothing you've ever gone after before. <laughs> Oh, Marcus! We've known each other for a long time. I don't believe in magic, a lot of superstitious hocus pocus. Hocus pocus. Besides, you know what a cautious fellow I am. Oh. Safety first. That's not Eagles. Let's go. Yeah, but it was the third. America. You could do America. anything. You could do anything? It's the 30s, yeah. Even smoking planes? The American dream. I have a load of those planes, man. First class. I like the color of the walls. Uh oh. A Nazi. Is it a Nazi? He looks yeah. Nazi. He's reading something that has a red thing with white text inside of it. Which means. That's a cool way to sleep. That's Nazi. 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 It's like Nazi, Nazi, but with a, an N. And you don't say it with as much enthusiasm as you would Yahtzee. <laughs> Nazi! Na <laughs> Nazis! Boy, we're getting cancelled. That was yeah. pretty terrible. Uh, we, we already are. Uh, sorry about that. Indiana flying over India? Indiana? Oh, Indiana, Indiana in India. You know there's a state <laughs> called Indiana? I know. The person in the movie shushed someone, and we all shut sh up. <laughs> it's it's okay, he has it's so okay. much power, that guy. I can't tell if that was a man or a woman. Look Perhaps at that Asian lady, like... She's, she's here for it. That's kind of gross. Let's start it! 
story. Ah. I, I was kidding. It's an act. So cool. Uh, how the fuck does he drink it like that? Yeah! An absolute psycho. Oh, oh there he goes. Oh, oh. he passed out. I'm glad we have the translation. But, yeah, really useful. We would need that Plan 9 uh, old device to translate everything for us. <laughs> yep. Oh boy. Hello, Marion. Indiana Jones. Always knew someday you'd come walking back through my door. Well, she's she's mad at him. I need one of the pieces your father collected. <laughs> Ah! Oh, 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 oh. Called That's it. I never meant to hurt you. I was a child. I was in love. It was wrong and you knew it. You knew what you were doing. Now I do. This is my place. Get out! Was he I a child? You don't have to be happy about it. I hope so. I need one of the pieces your father collected. A bronze piece about this size with a hole in it off center with a crystal. You know the one I mean? Yeah. Where's Abner? Oh, it's her bar. Abner? It's cool. Yeah. Abner's dead. Oh, there. Down. Courts. Abner was sorry for dragging me all over this earth looking for his little bits of. Why doesn't she call him dad? Stuck in this dive. I think she's mad Maybe at him. Everybody's sorry for something. It's a yeah. worthless bronze medallion, Mary, and you're gonna give it to me. Rude. Bucks. Damn. That's a lot of cash. It's worthless. Um, so it's a day's work for me. It's important, Marion. Trust me. Bullshit. Come back tomorrow. Why? Because I said so, that's why. Oh, maybe yes. Ha! See you tomorrow, Indiana Jones. They said the name of the movie in the movie. Whoa! It's easier when it's the name. It's a, a name section. At least she didn't go see smart Indiana Jones, Raider of the Lost Ark. That would have been a bit much. Oh. She's, She's wearing it! Nice. Wow, it is ginormous. Why would That's she so wear that? How did you not notice that she had that like on her? That's bronze? It looks like gold. That's movie magic it for looks you. looks heavy too. Imagine all that she could do with that money. She could gamble it, she could use it for alcohol drugs. or drugs, hookers. It's just it's too good. Steel games. Oh, oh no! The Nazis. That man looks like a Nazi. The bar is crawl line. We are, we are not thirsty. You? What do you want? What the hell? He is creepy. Surely he told you there would be other interested parties. He must have slipped his mind. The man is. Nefarious. <laughs> the way he laughs is like really grossing me out. Sounds like a dog. He's really good. Do you still have it? <laughs> yeah. No. Oh. Why don't you tell me where the piece is right now? Listen, Air Mac. Nobody tells me what to do in my place. Let me show you what I am used to. Nick! He's about to... Yeah. Yowch. That's a lot of degrees. I can be reasonable. That time is past. He's crazy. I'll tell you everything. Yes, I know you will. Oh. Let her go. Let her go. They ain't like shit. Uh oh. Oh. Good oh, shot. No. Same. Priority. Is she gonna do like fire breath thingy? Oh no, she, she just drank. Yep. So, Indiana Jones is a killer? Probably. But he shot someone in the head. Whiskey. He killed him. Shoot him. <laughs> Shoot him both. Well, that's awkward. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I didn't 
for a long time in his hand before he like. I feel like it would have yeah. stuck to his skin or something. His reflexes are pretty bad. Should get that checked out, buddy. Do Nazis have free health care? <laughs> pretty sure they don't. Mm, that's a good question. My medallion. My bar. Now, sounds like a good, a good deal to me. Nepal! Where are they going? Marrakesh? Iraq? Jordan. Jordan is around that area. Cairo. Cairo. She's so beautiful. She's very pretty. I like her dress. Paradise on Earth. Ah! What is this? Where did this animal come from? Mm. Is that the same monkey that in... Uh, exactly like my cat. Yeah. In uh, Pirates of the Caribbean? You don't have to keep it here just because of me! If it is, it's a very popular monkey. You know, maybe that Indiana Jones started his career. I knew the Germans would hire you, Sala. You're the best... Oh, in Night of the Museum! Pretty sure that, that monkey was dead by now. This movie came out in the 80s. When did they, find they live long. They have not one brain among them. How long does a monkey live? Acrimonious, put it up on the screen. Yep. What's his name? Balosh. It's important. Look. Belosh. <laughs> Belak. The Germans have a great advantage over us. They are near to discovering the Well of Souls. They're not going to find it without this. Don't show it around to everyone. That's how they get it. The Ark. If it is there, Atanis, then it is something that man was not meant to disturb. Death has always surrounded it. It is not of this earth. Do we need the monkey? Huh? What do you mean? It's a gift from God. That way about our baby. Yeah. You shut your looks too. <laughs> and your brain. <laughs> I noticed that. She's a smart little thing. He's like my cat. Yeah, they uh, look the same yep. too. She'll be alright, have a date. Exactly like my cat. Marion. Hey, what's this? It's a date. You eat them. Oh. Monkey. Oh no, it's evil. It's an evil monkey. Evil monkey. That's sad. The Nazis. Yeah. Oh. Of course. Oh, the. The monkey did it. Why would they That's teach a up. monkey to do the that? The Nazi monkey. That's terrible. <laughs> An evil Nazi monkey? That's a new thing. Fucking Nazis. Is it in this movie, that, like the famous scene where someone challenges Indiana Jones with like swords and then he shoots and then it's all funny? I don't know. I don't know. Raise eight or nine kids like a friend Sala. Who says I haven't? Ha <laughs> I do. Dad had you figured a long time ago. Oh, now he's dead. Mm. He said you were a bum. Oh, he's being generous. The most gifted bum he ever trained. It took a hell of a lot for you to alienate him. Not much, just you. Interesting. Mm. He's just in the back beating him with, like, a <laughs> little <laughs> container. Uh, no. no remorse. He threw her. Sometimes you just gotta be thrown, I guess. Sometimes you just gotta be thrown. I wouldn't want to get whip. I want to learn how to use a whip. <laughs> that was effective. <laughs> the little the asshole. Nazi monkey! Fucking Nazi monkey. How can you make a monkey a Nazi? It's just wrong. Oh, it's that famous scene. Is it? Yeah. Oh my god. I, I thought, thought you guys it was knew Dark about Vader. this. It was a meme. <laughs> <laughs> They're all happy! They're all <laughs> cheering! That's awesome. How did she not break through the bottom of the basket? 
They're holding it. She's a very Boy. dainty lady. Why is he almost her shirtless? Oh. oh. Oh, that's close. How are they so fast? Oh, oh no. Why oh. is he ruined uh, so many days? <laughs> is that laundry? And then it goes away like nothing happened. Oh. Oh. Dynamite. Oh. There's a lady in your TNT. <laughs> oh, man. Uh oh. Uh -oh. There's explos explosives oh. in this vehicle. Wow. Ooh. <gasps> Kaboom. Oh, come on. Well, she's in the other movies, but your girlfriend just blew up. No, she's clearly dead. End of the movie. <laughs> Good, I like it. <laughs> Chilling with the Nazi. Chilling with the Nazi monkey. How dare you? He's even drinking with him. We're friends now. The monkey has overcome his racist tendencies for friendship. <laughs> He's been rehabilitated. <laughs> with alcohol. Well, doesn't doesn't Indiana Jones have blue eyes though? Jones. Maybe that's why the monkey accepts him. It's a movie filled with Nazis. You're filled with Nazis. We're friends. <laughs> Nazi fucker. Belloc. Good afternoon, Dr. Jones. I ought to kill you right now. Not a very private place for a murder? You just shot someone well, in the middle of the street. <laughs> other, that's a good point. Please sit down before you fall down. You and I are very much alike. Archaeology is our religion. I am a shadowy reflection of you. Now you get nasty. Nasty. You know. Look at this. It's worthless. Ten dollars from a vendor in the street. But I take it, I bury it in the sand for a thousand years, it becomes priceless, like the ark. The ark is made of gold. Yeah. I feel like there's a price discrepancy. Yeah, but the price is way more because of its meaning. Right. And there's stories so, that like, have been made around it. So there's still a price discrepancy between a stupid pocket watch with no... Yeah, but in a thousand years we'll say like, Oh, this was a tool used to tell the time that God wanted us to know. It was the only one in the world. Why don't they shoot the kids? <laughs> it's a joke. Aww. He stole a random person's monkey though. Like that's not even his monkey. He saw it get <laughs> on someone else. It's a Nazi monkey. You can steal him all you want. So yeah. if you're Nazi, you're someone's property? Well, Indiana Jones yep. killed someone. A Nazi and therefore it makes it okay. Oh, the monkey's mad. There he is dead. Yes, I know. Life goes on, Indy. There is the proof. Oh. Undercover monkey. These dates? Why is a child feeding you? Why not? Oh, me feed yourself. Oh my god. Creepy McCreeperson. Oh, he's poisoning the dates. It will be a date to the end. Where do you get a copy of the headpiece? No duplicates of it anywhere. I tell you only what I saw with my own eyes. And surrounding the crystal, on one side, there were raised markings, just like that one. Out away from no. The no. <laughs> oh, no. 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 Goodbye, Not the monkey. Nazi monkey. Look here. Look. Sit down. Look. Look. Sit down. Come here. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Sit Matthew. Down. My commentary is always welcome. Not to disturb the Ark of the Covenant. Oh no. Wait! And take back one Kadam to honor the Hebrew god whose Ark this is. You said their headpiece only had markings on one side. Belloc's staff is too long. They're, They're digging, digging in, in the, the wrong, wrong place. place. <laughs> <laughs> I am the monarch of the sea. Oh, oh no! The Nancy monkey! No! Everyone that Indy comes in contact with dies. Oh no, okay. I'm sad. Are you depressed yet? Always. Always. Oh, 
It's a long way down. I want to be an archaeologist, but like that. I want to <laughs> repel and fight Nazis and own a monkey. That's a pretty good thing to aspire to. Yeah, but I chose healthcare. <laughs> like a fool. Why would you do that? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> now if a it's Nazi crazy. gets wounded, you're obligated to help him. Yeah, um, but I don't right. have a lot of Nazis that are doing plastic surgery right now, so... Well, oh, you'd be surprised. a lot of tattoo removals. Uh. Yeah, I, don't, I don't do that. I just do titties and faces. Itty bitty ditties. What are you doing, sir? He has to find Looking the correct for spot the holes. to put this back. As all men do. <laughs> Well, this is traumatic. Whoa! Ooh, whoa. whoa! That's a fire hazard. Well, while we have a few minutes here before we continue the movie, the guy at the beginning who says, Poison is still fresh, three days. That guy is Alfred Molina. He's the actor who played Dr. Octopus in Spider Man 2. Oh. Congratulations. A few more things interesting, and then I'll, I'll, I'll leave you with this. Spielberg and Lucas were friends. Spielberg made it big with Jaws and Close Encounters. And of course, Lucas, we know from Star Wars. And in 1980, Lucas said, hey, I have this other idea I want to do. Do you want to do it, Spielberg? And Spielberg said, absolutely, as long as you don't write it. I'm paraphrasing, of course, but that's basically it. So they got a guy named Lawrence Kasdan, who's an amazing writer who did this. So they used Lucas's good ideas, Spielberg's amazing directing, Kazdan's remarkable storytelling, and they insisted and got John Williams to play the music. I'll tell you more about John Williams some other times because it's a long sequence, but I just want to leave you with this. The next part we're going to see is where the action kicks in, and it features two unforgettable action scenes, separated only by a brief moment of respite, where Indy catches his breath in a tent. One of my favorite segues in movie history. His ally, Sala, comes into the tent where Indy is resting. Now, the character of Sala, you should know, is played by the actor who played Gimli the Dwarf in the Lord of the Rings trilogy. So, Sala comes into the tent and reveals that the Ark has been spotted nearby and that now it's being carried on a truck. Out of breath, resigned, Indy tiredly asks, Truck? What truck? Cue the perfect music score, and off Indy goes again on a perilous adventure. Truck? What truck? Two of the best action scenes of all time, back to back, in the same film, all linked by a single music cue, and an actor going, truck, what truck? Impeccable editing, inspiring music, tight pacing, and evocative storytelling. I love this movie. And now, back to the show. And we'll just take a moment to appreciate Theo's position. Because what a babe. <laughs> he's just babies is the problem, but he's a little... Mother, <laughs> give me beds. Mother, I desire attention. <laughs> Mother, puts... can you hear? <laughs> he puts his face on my face because he wants love. Is he it just breathing against your face? <laughs> Yes! Alright, dude, get down. Get Theo, down. what a weirdo. Oh my god, he's so weird. He was just like, hello. Okay, let's watch a movie. One last thing. Uh, you know the scene where Indy shoots the guy and uh, it's like everyone's going, yay! The reason for that is on that day, Harrison Ford was supposed to have a very long fight with that big, big guy with the sword. But Harrison Ford was very ill that day, and he said, can I just please shoot him? And Spielberg went, hey, that's a good idea. And it became one of the most famous scenes from the movie. That's it. That's all. Cute. That's awesome. He's gone. Oh! That's a new one. Oh. Nazis. That's absolutely not a red flag ever. She's alive. I thought you were dead. I must have switched baskets. <sighs> oh. Okay. 
for you. I'm gonna be kissed like that. Damn. Let's get me out of here quick. I think they like each other. That's a weird theory. From I don't know where he got that from. I know where the ark is, Marion. Looks here. I'll take you out of here now. They'll start combing the place for us. Are you crazy? I don't think she would have kissed him if she knew he was just gonna leave her there. I don't think so. Is he but hurry? You probably shouldn't leave it pointed at the site. <laughs> Big red arrow on the floor. Perhaps a girl can have this. I tell you, the girl knows nothing. But it needn't concern you. I'm the perfect man for this kind of work. Oh, God. You. Oh. You would have done a no. good, a good penguin in. A That's a pretty sick tattoo. Batman. Yucky! I just want to say a speculation of mine that the reason the Nazis only have one side of the medallion and are digging in the wrong place is beca because they're basing all of the information only from the one side that got imprinted and burned in Toffler's hand. That's pretty Makes cool. Sense. Ah, kiddo. Yuck! Man, you. Yuck! Maybe you need some plastic surgery. You know Sorry, who to call. Oh. I would, I, I would like this scene, but with the music of uh, the seven dwarves that go to work <laughs> from the Disney movie. But also, why is he not working? <laughs> He's just standing. Clear it off. Come on, find the edges. Yes, white man. Yeah, what is this? <laughs> He's really not working. He's just looking. I hope they get paid after this. I hope so too. Me too. It won't be there. Whoa. Ancient air. It's like Ancient when you open a, a can of soda and it just. Psh. Ancient air. Name. Oh! Whoa! Is that Anubis? That's spooky. Why does the floor move? Oh no, is it snakes? Of course it's snakes. Oh, it's snakes that are afraid of the light, right? Just like in the Lego movie? Oh, I don't think they care. Yeah, they don't seem to care. <laughs> How have they been surviving this long? They eat each other. Do they now? They eat each other, and that's a lot for love. <laughs> snakes. Why did it have to be snakes? Asps. Very dangerous. You go first. The most poisonous snake in go the first. world. <laughs> Can I ask you to speak after they've done speaking sometimes? <laughs> but like, how are we supposed to know? Right, well, from here on out, it's action, so don't worry. That's what you said last time. Yep. I lied! <laughs> I lied! <laughs> oh no. Dungeons and Dragons comes back. I must apologize for the treatment of you. No food, no water. What kind of people are these friends of yours? Not my friends. It's beautiful. I would very much like to see you in it. Creepy. No. A better one. <laughs> We're about to get married, girl. Soon they will come to arm you. Unless you are able to give me something to placate them. You! I have no loyalty to Jones. He's brought me nothing but trouble. Very scandalous dress for the 30s. Isn't it a bit weird? Too much fluff. It's pretty weird. Why does she have a wedding dress in the desert? Why don't you have a wedding dress, Emma? <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm not in a question. desert. <laughs> well, there you go! She has a wedding dress because she is in the <laughs> desert. Um. <sighs> Whoa. Oh, God. Do you know snakes move the same way our stomach and colon moves? Oh. Yeah. Interesting. Uh. They, snakes move through their organs' peristalsis. That is both fascinating and very gross. I, I did know. not need to know that. Well, you're welcome. 
Is he just gonna set fire to the snakes? Yep. Bye, snakes. Oh, I said we better fire. see no snakes were armed during this movie. That's the end. <laughs> no snake. No snakes. Or monkeys. <laughs> monkeys too. No monkeys were harmed. The, the making of this the film. monkey's fucking dead, man. Yeah, be a man. Yeah. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Real men drink Meek. alcohol. Drink is that? Tequila. I don't know, but it's clear. Vodka? Clear alcohol. Absinthe. Absinthe. So what do they drink in yeah, Egypt? Right. Well, water, I guess. That's alcohol. Oh, it's a bit dry. Hang on. I found it's it. A shiny thing. <laughs> what is this stuff, Renee? I grew up with this. It's my family label. <laughs> What's so funny? He's acting. He's acting like she had too much to make him drink more. <laughs> oh! Well, I have to be going now, Renee. She's also not as drunk. No. Ew! A big uh, Nazi bad guy. He's ugly. Dressing for the wrong occasion. Oh, come on. By the way, he's it's really not good looking. Iraq, A R A K. The clear alcohol commonly drank in the Middle East. It's it made of potatoes. Let me see. What the Snake fuck? venom. Grapes. Ooh, like wine? And no. kind of an anise, uh, like anise, 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 anise. Anise, like the like regles, whatever that that's called. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Licorice. Licorice. Ask your mom to bring us a bottle. Okay, I will. Except Qatar is a dry country. <laughs> They're not allowed alcohol. No, it's illegal. You can be put in prison for it. Oh, that's Ooh. rough. This there thing looks certain, fancy. There are certain places like Yankee stores that sell them, but they have a special permit for it and like a we license. Just, you have we just to have saw it. the 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 thing. The Ark of the The thing in the thing. It's the Ten Commandment. Box. Box. <laughs> That's beautiful. After all these years. It's God protected. It looks expensive. It's God protected. This is the kind of protection I want to have. Alright, pick it up! They're gonna abandon you in there. Of I course. God likes objects, not you people. Like it too many people will always die. You would use a bulldozer to find the China Cup. Kevin, wake up, man! Oh my god. Of course. Oh, Salah! Oh, hello! Oh. What an asshole. No, it's Salah. Why don't you come on down here? I'll show you. Thank you, my friend, but I think we're all very comfortable up here. Who knows? In a thousand years, even you may be worth something. <laughs> Son of a bitch. But I do not wish to leave you down in that awful place, all alone. Slimy Biff, you let me go! Nice. Ah! Hang on! Don't fall! Don't fall. <laughs> Greatest advice I've ever heard. Yeah, he really said don't fall. He had an idea. <laughs> she climbed onto him. <laughs> the girl was mine. It was not to be, Sherry. Is he French or something? Get you for this! He's supposed to be French. Adieu. French. He's French. Uh, that son of a French bitch. Man. Yeah, imagine speaking French. Yeah, embarrassing. So weird. <laughs> Snake, 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 snake. Take this. Wave it at anything that slithers. Slithers in. Slither in. Where'd you get this? From him? I was trying to escape! Ah, oh, that's the weirdest poop I've ever seen. There's a spawner the on the hole. other side of the wall. You need to break it. You break it, you buy it. Oh! 
Whoa, copyrighted music. Oh, for <laughs> sure. We might be fucked with this one, actually, now that I think about it. <laughs> yep. It's gonna be a tough one to get around, that's for sure. I just make a video of us uh, talking without any <laughs> movie. We'll just be talking. Why is it screaming? Why is it screaming? Oh. Ugh. Wesh. Oh, light. That was easy. Because he's smart. <laughs> There's a guy there. Chilling in the I corner. I know that airplane. We're gonna fly it out of here. Wow. Okay. So. Hop off, beefy man. Nazi bodybuilder. Oh my gosh. Come here. Hot camp. Junge. Come on, Dada. Whoa. It didn't work. <laughs> oh, yes, balls of steel. One hit and it was done. I didn't like the noise that made. It's very crunchy. I think it was celery. Crunching celery. They do that in <laughs> movie things for the sounds. Does she know how to fly a plane? Well, I hope so. Have to. She's stuck in there now. Oh. One way to do That's it. Intense. I would love to do that. Sack. Sit in a thing and just. Oh boy, aviation fuel is like hella combustible and burns really hot. Oh my. She's going crazy. Same. Wow. Is that Thor Johnson? <laughs> he looks oh. oh shit! Oh no! That's a bad All way to go. He's right. me now. Woo. Have it put on the truck. I want plenty of protection. Ja, wohl, Herr Obi. Lol. I love him. Indiana Jones. What a man. <laughs> Holy smoke, my friends! I, I'm so pleased you're not dead! Indy, Indy, we have no time. If you still want the Ark, it has been loaded onto a truck for Cairo. Truck? What truck? That truck. Get back to Cairo. Get us some transport to England. Boat, plane, anything. I'm going after that truck. Oh. I don't know, I'm making this up as I go. Honesty is the best policy. Smart. He's so cool. Oh. Look at that, it's so well shot. <laughs> Look at all that horsepower. <laughs> it's just one horsepower. <laughs> Listen to this music, please. Yeah, but it's gonna get copyrighted. I just asked you to listen. Should have thought. Ooh, ooh! Be careful, horse. That sounds like copyrighted music too. Yeah. But I can. This is. Yeah, we should come in this whole scene. Did I the see the horse. It's pretty Who cool. Did... Now he's going on a truck, throwing Come people on. over. Wait, I have a question. <laughs> did the person who wrote the music for Indiana Jones also write any of the music for Star Wars? It's very yep. similar, so... Because there is a lot of similar scores. Every single movie Spielberg has done has been with John Williams, whether it's Jaws or his more recent Fablemans. The Wilhelm's... Will... Willem? Will... The Scream. Willem... Willenheim? Willem Scream. There is a person on your truck. Not anymore. I think that person's oh. dead. Yep, they're not doing too good. Probably some broken bones. Get fucking squished. You can call that reckless driving. Oh really my. reckless. That's copyrighted music too. Well, it's the same one, <laughs> playing over and over. 
Yep. Oh. oh no. That's how they make them run. snakes in there. Leeches. I had a leech on me once. Eesh. It was the scariest five seconds of my life. It's... Yep. Did I it can suck imagine. Their blood? Oh. You know how many brains oh they have? How many brains? None. Do they have? 32. I think it was something around that, yeah. We looked it up last week. How can they? <laughs> how can they have 32 brains? <laughs> and all of them want how does, food. How does that work? <laughs> it's 32 brains, but for the whole species. So My they only share. brain is confused they now. Share the brain. <laughs> The gardener's not gonna be happy about this. You think, you think there's a gardener just doing it, doing gardening? Yeah, the jungle all over gardener. The jungle? <laughs> You've just never heard of the jungle it's gardener? You. It's one guy. It's yeah. one guy. He walks around and he does all the gardening. Yeah. Yep. Curses in German. Germain? German. Curses in Germain. <laughs> German. German oh, Cole. German. Germain la rivière. <laughs> Curses in Germain. That guy is too old for oh. this. Hey. No. I'm too old for this. Come on, are you like 12? Oh, I'm, nah. I'm 44. Oh, Kiro! Oh. Well, I think I should teach her about consent. <laughs> no, everybody gives consent to Kiro. Look at her, she's yeah. a baby. Well, I don't really have a choice. <laughs> the bottom of his boots are gonna be dusted. Yeah. Oh, okay. Watch your pants. Watch your butt! Ow, that's gotta hurt. Wasn't that a way to kill people in the... Like yes. when when they didn't have cars, they would attach them to horses and just... It's not a way to kill Indiana Jones. No, his it's clothes like... are indestructible. Fuck yeah, man. Get him. Kick him out. Come on, he's just misguided. In Nazis. He deserves that. Ran that. Over Bald. Fuck him. Bad. Doesn't even know how to drive. I also don't know how to drive. That's, That's a huge problem. He could drive very slowly just to compensate. At least I don't drive like I want to kill someone. You like Indiana Jones or like Zach? <laughs> Both. I'll take it if you say I drive like Indiana Jones. Oh boy. That is not That's what a I good mean. compliment. That's what you said. Somebody don't even have a driver's license. <laughs> yeah, but I know how to drive. No, you don't. Yeah, no, I know how to drive. I don't like to drive. That's why I don't have a driver's why license. Why the hell would you just throw a papaya like that? They're all Is happy. that a papaya? Or a small melon. Who's the captain? Mr. Katanga. Mr. Katanga, these are my friends. They are my family. Mr. Jones, I've heard a lot about you, sir. Your appearance is exactly the way I imagined. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. I am already missing you. Aww. That is for fire. That is for your children. And this is for you. Oh. Beautiful. Thank you. So pleased with himself. Ishtar is a soaring soul as free as a mountain bird. What? So, a way to say thank you in Egypt. It's how me and Diego greet each other. From him. Oh, that's sweet. Katanga. So, his left cheek, right cheek, in the middle. Oh. <gasps> What'd you say? Not the man I knew ten years ago. It's not the years. It's the mileage. What a wimp. What the fuck? I don't need a nurse. I just want to sleep. He's such a baby. Marion, leave me alone. 
us this year. Go away. Wow. Well, God damn it, anywhere doesn't it hurt? Here. <laughs> Here. Oh, that's cute. Oh, <laughs> so cute. This is too good. It's what giving I mean, mom kiss my boo boo. Indiana Jones as mommy That's shoes cute. confirmed. Clearly. Damn, they have such spicy kissing scenes. I'm skeptical. <laughs> he just falls asleep. Jones. Oh. <laughs> Jones. That's pretty iconic. Oh, he's he's had a big day. Yep. Oh boy. <laughs> Is this magic? Engine's magic. Wait, why is she naked? Why is she oh, happy? I think they did it. Yeah. A he man and asleep. a woman sleeping together. They did together. it in the morning. Huh? Oh, that's a big gun. I want to go on a submarine. Are those pirates? They look like Nazis. Oh, it burned off the Nazi symbol. Oh, no, yeah. not the magic fire of God. Yeah, he was like, hell no. I don't do Nazis. Well, if God created everything, he created Nazis. Yup. It's all part of his plan. Why would you say something so controversial? Jones is dead. I killed him. He was of no use to us. This girl, He's just in a tomb. Nobody else see him? No. If it's your goal, go in peace with it, but leave us a girl. It would reduce our loss on this trip. Savage. We will take what we wish. And then decide whether or not to blow your ship from the water. He wants to take the woman. Bruh. If she fails to please me, you may do with her as you wish. <laughs> yeah. Is this human trafficking? Seems like it. I'd Men say... Being... Yucky. I'd say the Nazis have done worse things. Where? Yeah. <laughs> He's just climbing on something. You gotta, you gotta get in it before it goes underneath. What's the plan? <laughs> he doesn't have one. I don't know. I'm making this up as I go. He's making it on the spot. Why is he still wet? This might be controversial, but Nazis gave Fact. cinema an enemy for all of their movies. Yep. That is true. I agree. What? Every movie in during that time used Nazis as the main enemy. Or Russians. Yeah, Russians too. Oh. Guten Tag. Wasch dich mal, damit du nicht aussiehst wie ein Schwein bei deinem Standgericht. Steh auf. I am uncomfortable with the thought of this Jewish ritual. Would you be more comfortable opening the Ark in Berlin for your Fuhrer, finding out only then if the sacred pieces of the Covenant are inside, and obtain the one true Ark? His accent is very far from French. Yeah. <laughs> I need to say. I don't know. I don't know. He deserved that. Yeah. I think he deserved a little bit more. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine being no. a flag bearer. <laughs> yeah, that's a not. bit weird. Why are they doing this? Why not? It's completely useless. And this dude is really ugly. He's weirdly bald. It looks like yeah. they shaved him. And, but they yeah. kept like the long hair in the back because I feel like you but don't the long hair is very dense like yeah yeah fake balding yeah I think it's offensive to bald people yeah and future bald people oh boy too. that's one oh. way to do it he's not fucking around Jones. the girl is there Jones see he don't care why would you run that way, though? Surely you don't think you can escape from this island. It depends on how reasonable we're all willing to be. All I want is the girl. She's happy. If we refuse, 
Well, like 30 minutes ago, he was like, I'm just gonna leave you tied up here so I can go get the Ark. So. Let me just do this shit for my personal gain and let you die. Character development, I suppose. Blow it up. Zurück! Shut up! Yes, blow it up! Blow it back to God. All your life yeah. has been spent. You want to see it open as well as I. We are simply passing through history. This. That's a pretty dramatic speech. This is history. I thought it was bigger. Ugh. Do as you will. He looks like a frog. But in a bad way. I'd like to shoot a rocket launcher. I'd and like to shoot rise. a lot of things. Oh, that's kind of pretty. It's God made. I guess God has good taste or something. You're about to get vaporized, my guy. You're spoiling the movie. I think it's funny. And it's juicy fruit inside. Sand! Yay! Holy sand. <laughs> he laughs like Gab. <laughs> <laughs> this is so right. We're full of sand. It's happening. God is not happy. That's on you, my guy. Your only job was to not open the scary box. The scary box. Ah, he coming! Okay, that is a scary box. <laughs> you can do that! It has the word of God inside. Of course it's a scary box. <laughs> that isn't scary. Marion, don't look at it. Shut your eyes, Marion. Don't look at it, no matter what happens. What happens when you look at it? It... Eats your soul. Yeah, it is not your friend. So how does he know that? He's a... God made. He's an expert in all things. Don't look at right. Keep your eyes shut! Demons. Wow. So it's a killing device. <laughs> Oh my god, through the camera. Oh! 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 That's new. Nice. Okay. Really cool. I was unaware they exploded. It's on reverse. God offers a convenient body cleaning service. Yeah! Oh my god, there it goes! <laughs> I think that was the lid. No? Maybe. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh wow, convenient. I'm done. Let me just go back to sleep for the next so, 2500 years. It's called so Odin's listen, sleep. Do not open the box. Listen, learn. Are all the evil people dead? Yeah. The world is rid of evil. Thanks to God. Thanks to God. You should put that thing back where you found it. You need to have sex in the golden box. Go what? Don't get in the golden box. Yep. Fuck the golden box. Where is the Ark? The Ark is somewhere very safe. From whom? We have top men working on it right now. Who? Nazis. Top men. Oh, I wanted top less men. Hey, what happened? Fools. Bureaucratic What'd fools. What'd they say? They don't know what they've got there. Well, I know what I've got here. I know. Good. Buy a drink. You know. A drink? Her That's liver cute. has got to be dead. Nah. She's too cool. Cool people don't get sick. 
Yep, that's just yeah, a that's, rule. That's facts. Oh, so they're just putting oh, yeah. it in a box. And that's I remember it. this scene. Then you just put it with the other magical artifacts. That they all find. Whoa. Copyrighted music. Whoa! Whoa! Yeah. What a good movie. That was but good. I, Turn down the volume a bit. I like totally that this insinuates that the government has found like multiple powerful items all around the world and they're just storing it in a giant warehouse somewhere. It's because <laughs> they don't want the bad people to get their hands on it. It's so for it's the greater like good. Just, America is known for it. The they're not good. even they're not they're not even well shelved or anything. Like they don't look like there's any sort of organization. They're yeah. just like box. Just box. <laughs> the power of God into a corner. <laughs> yeah, but there's so no like shouldn't. shelving space. It's they like they I have know numbers. they have a list and it says number nine million five hundred is word of God. The power of the power of a word of God. But that's terrible. It's like I know I put the word of God somewhere around aisles. 3 million and 35 and 3 million and 36, but I can't just, I can't remember where. Yeah, between between the, the, the staff of Ra and the eye of Maggie. <laughs> that is it, you know, politely wedged between the world's most powerful items. There's the devil's fork right next, and um... If you look Poseidon's long enough, you could probably find Jesus. Yeah, he's still in one of those boxes. <laughs> Jesus is in one of those boxes. He came back to life, uh, to life a second time, and then they were like, "We'll we'll put you in a box this time." <laughs> the government was just like, in. "Nope, <laughs> get in there." Uh, I'm really sorry if you're Christian. <laughs> what? I promise the government isn't hiding Jesus from you, but you never know. I know. It's only hiding uh, well, reptile well, people. That's a good in thing because shops. it means Jesus is real. Jesus? You see it one way. Well, Jesus, Jesus was real, right? Yeah, yeah. But they, they have a good reason to put him in a box somewhere. It's not just a random uh, homeless man. Mm, maybe he was. Okay. I'm, I'm too tired to have this discussion. Yeah, you would, like, you would have been like a good, like an Edward. He was Edward of the times. Edward was Jesus, Jesus confirmed. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. Edward, that's, that's, Edward he took a weird turn. <laughs> I don't Edward, know how you made that bridge. Yeah, yeah, because you're not letting me speak. Edward con uh, convinced the church to make his movie about aliens. Just as Jesus convinced the world of God's true power. Same thing. Thanks for Is tuning that... in, guys. See you next week. Is that what he did? I thought he just went around helping people and performing miracles. So which character would you and like to play? <laughs> Hold Jesus. Hold on a well, second. I'd like to play Jesus. Do you want, do you want right. us to speak about the movie more than religion? I just, a... no, keep going. Yeah. Hold on, I want to say something. Say something. Because of the inter... I want to say something. Because of the interference around Solaron, my instruments are a little wonky, so when we're around this sentient sun, things sometimes act a little differently. So tonight, you are officially allowed to pick heroes you would like to play from this movie as a game, but also villains. Well, I wouldn't Ooh. pick Nazis. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Who do we have that's a villain that's not a Nazi? I don't know. The villains were all kind the of French gross. Dude. No, I would, I would totally I would be the penguin. You would be the guy that goes that Can last, I be like, the <laughs> monkey? <laughs> Technically, it's a villain. The monkey, the Nazi I monkey. I think, then. I think Tama as the monkey is a good choice. Yep, I'm a monkey. Whoa, whoa, um, whoa! You're 
You're a monkey. You're There's a whip master. <laughs> Things are going very wrong tonight. Zach! Nazis. This is you're not going to go more, well for us. You're making more work for Matthew. Yep. Okay. I, I would like to play Marion. Marion. Oh. Kiki, who would you play? Mm, I would like to play... Indiana Jones. Yeah, I'd kind of be down to do Indiana Jones. Yep, yep. I see so, it. So, I'm the penguin. Whatever his name was. I don't know. The guy that got his hand burnt. Thomas is the monkey and we're against you two. That's Indiana Jones. and <laughs> Yeah, yeah power yeah. couple. I mean, I like that. Like... Monkey. Do I we like have to that. do the, the gesture with our hand if we play Nazis? I don't think so. I'm not sure this game could, do would it. go great if we actually do that. We'll get cancelled. Alright, so to our Patreons, go vote for anything else because this is a bad idea. No, no, no. We can find okay. the Dungeons and Dragons equivalent to the Nazi symbol, which would be something like, you know... Yeah, but it's still the same concept. And a screenshot. It's inspired well, it's, from them, it's, so it's even worse. No, it's not. In, it's inspired from the the Nazis. We would be human killings, killing. Uh, don't 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 think about it. <laughs> no, but we're <laughs> not, we're not what making language it was that? Is the sun against language. us? Like, if it's a living sun, is the sun God? So we're, so the sun can't be the Fuhrer in that game. This is getting we talk complicated. about the Nazi, uh, it's going okay. really too am I, far this time. Am I the only one that doesn't understand what's going on here? Is the, talking uh, about Nazis. No, but it's the worst movie to be the bad guys, I think, because they're okay. all Nazis. <laughs> I'd, li I'd like to say one last thing, though. In my mind, Nazis. Indiana Jones, as I remembered it, was better than this. Now, the only thing I saw was God against Nazis. And I don't think that's a good good way to tell a story. A, a, a Nazi monkey. Also. That was so, pretty cool. Well, then, they let's get into it. to the Hail Hitler sign. <laughs> the that's fucked up. Well, let's get into it, my pets. We just watched Raiders of the Lost Ark, the first of the Indiana Jones movie. What did you think of it? Did you enjoy it? It was a good action yeah, movie. I would like to say so. It was still good. It's just I remembered it so much cooler. The monkey was cool. Well, when you're well, a kid, everything is great in your cool mind. Like that, but... Yeah. It was nice. It was a lot better than a lot of stuff we've watched on this channel so far. We've watched a lot of great stuff in the beginning, too. It's just there was like a small moment where we watched bad movies for fun. We went through a phase. <laughs> yeah, it was a phase. Well, be careful what you wish for, because it might come back one day. <laughs> we did get a comment about it. They were like, never watch something this bad again on the <laughs> plan line. <laughs> <laughs> well, my sweets, I'm afraid it is all the time I have for you this week. It is now time to let you all get back to your horses your whips, and your trucks, as well as to your duties aboard my ship. And to your cryo chambers until we reach our next destination. Not the but cryo not, chambers, fuck. But do not fret, my pets, for if the gods and the goddesses have anything to say about it, we could be seeing each other again very, very soon. Have a nice week, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. How did he know about the horse? Don't, don't How did your he know about the guys. horse? <laughs> It's gonna be fun. Yeah, yeah, and I said, I said don't, don't raise your hands too high. La belle touche finale. Yeah. Like, this, this episode was absolute fucking chaos. Constantly talking over one another. Yeah. 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 If you like what you see, if we manage to even give you a little tickle of the shivers, please be a dear and subscribe to our Patreon. In doing so, you'll get a say concerning which movies our fellow captives shall be watching throughout the month, and which of these fine classics should be adapted into a full-fledged D&D game, along with other bonus features as well. If not, please click like and subscribe in the description below. 
It really does help us out, you know. Well, it looks like we're going to be spending the next few weeks in orbit around Solaron, so we might as well try and catch a few rays of sunlight if you know what I mean. We have been in space for a rather long time after all. If you want to see the full story, please head on over to our Patreon, where each week I write a little short story about the adventures some of us have had while in orbit around the planets we visit during our shows. That's 21 short stories so far, exclusively to our Patreon subscribers. So be sure and check that out and let me know what you think, will ya? Next week, we shall be exploring more classics from cinematic history. In the meanwhile, we made a small accompaniment piece for this movie, Raiders. It is called, So, What is the Ark of the Covenant Anyways? In under 10 minutes. Go check it out on YouTube and let us know what you think, will ya? Until then, remember this advice from an old undead demilage who has seen better days. If you have people you love back home, please take care of them. And if you don't, and if you have no one, please take care of yourself. We'll see you all next week for brand new adventures. Until then, my pets, stay safe, stay brave, and toodaloo! Action, reaction. Yeah, it's just there's a can of uh, an empty can of food, a can of cat food in my recycling bin, and they're trying to get it. There is a Mimi. Did you give it? Is relentless. No, it's empty. I I already gave them the food that was inside. But they could play with it. A can. They have plenty of toys. You've never played with an empty metal can. That's okay, you rich boy. Je me suis mis de la poudre de Dorthos dans l'œil. Daphne! I'm sorry! <laughs> oh yeah, he's scared of snakes. That's better than being scared of birds. Hey, Yo. <laughs> Shots fired. Fuck you! You would be scared of birds. I fear birds. birds. It's rational and you are all assholes. <laughs> There's a lot of people talking over people. He looks yeah. Nazi. That's Nazi. 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 The Nazis. That man looks like a Nazi. A Nazi. Is it the Nazi? Big Nazis. Nazi bodybuilder. Nazi fucker. Oh. Nazis. The Nazis. It's like Nazi, but with a, an N. And you don't say it with as much enthusiasm as you would Yahtzee. <laughs> Nazi! Na <laughs> Nazis! The... the Nazis. Do Nazis have free healthcare? <laughs> Yeah, um, but I know right. a lot of Nazis that are doing plastic surgery right now, so... Well, oh, you'd be surprised. a lot of tattoo removals. Fucking Nazis. It's a Nazi monkey, you can steal him all you want. Fucking Nazi monkey. Chilling really with the Nazi monkey. How dare you. How can you make a monkey a Nazi? It's just wrong. He's even drinking with him. It's a movie filled with Nazis. You're filled with Nazis. He's talking the about Nazis. Boy, we're getting cancelled. Not the what, cryo not chambers! Fuck! Truck? What truck?